hello water signs welcome back to my channel presence of a goddess thank you guys for joining me today today is just going to be a general message for my water signs so if it resonates awesome i appreciate if you like comment subscribe and share it to those who you think it'll resonate too i do appreciate you and if it does not resonate i do apologize you can check your sun moon rising and other placements in your chart and if you want to book a personal reading with me the link is down below all right guys i'm gonna be using my ghetto oracle card deck first i already shuffled those because my hands been a little rough and i don't know they wasn't shuffling right um on camera with the other signs so y'all know so i have divine intervention um i have the other man or woman i have come correct or don't come at all <laughs> And I do have good parent, caregiver. Okay, so for some of you guys, um, you are a good parent. Do not let nobody tell you anything else. Parenting does not have a rule book. You do the best you can, the way you can. You get it how you live. All right, I have time is money. I have peace of mind. And I have sapiosexual. Honestly, clearly it tells me here that maybe a lot of people have been, for some of you guys, like this one specific person was trying to play you, basically. Um, for some of you guys, it could be multiple people that just be trying to play you, but you always get a divine intervention, always get like some discernment or some type of, um, like spirit just be like, ah, ah, get the fuck out the way. That's period. But let's see what's going on. Some of you guys don't even know that you are, um, you have been like protected from a certain person or people oh yeah look princess of wands and then i have the her font i told you divine intervention so i feel like you you getting a little fed up i feel like yeah you fired up somebody pissed you off it could be a water sign um or you could be the water sign take it as it resonates but I do get the energy that this person was trying to like, try to make it seem like you were gullible and you weren't. But what else you have for my fellow water signs, Cancer, Scorpio, my Pisces? Yeah, with the Ten of Cups. Why do I feel like... It could have been like a, your, your baby father, your baby mother, or it could be like a family member who got involved. Maybe a family member was messing with your person. Um, it could, I'm hearing a family affair. Yeah, look, Prince of Cups. Ooh, why did I say Prince of Pentacles and a Nine of Swords? But I also have Queen of Wands. So somebody could have been like older than you and they were messing with maybe another, like another woman with the same like, like a copycat. They were messing with a copycat. Somebody, mm, like that's, ooh. okay, Spirit, what are you trying to say? Like, yeah, the high priestess and the two of swords, like they was choosing from two people, like they didn't know who to pick. Um, it's like that it was a secret that wasn't told like they were keeping a secret about them messing with somebody else I feel like everybody knew but you type of energy but now you have a peace of mind or you're gonna have a peace of mind that you're now that it's coming out in the open you're very intellectual I feel, I feel like you was observing this like I said, I feel like you were protected from this person because this person did not come correct. Okay? And I don't know why they came at all. Yeah, like, look. With the uh, world card, you ended that cycle with this, this toxic person. I don't want to say toxic, but it could be just a karmic. Like, somebody who was just no good for you. Um, you ended a cycle with them. It could be with a Capricorn. But I do get the death card. Like, this is an emphasis of, like, if you have not ended it, you need to end it. Because this person is trying to play you. Yeah, look, this person is saying you need to end it with a swift. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm not laughing at y'all, but I'm just like, clear as day. Like, spirits is saying, like, this is divine intervention. If you found out about another woman or another man, um, and, and, yeah. 
And so with the Seven of Pentacles, this person was trying to like build two homes. Like that's the energy I'm getting. And they real smooth with it. Like real GQ with it. Like they know how to lie. Like you get what I'm saying? Like they know how to lie. And I feel like now you just real nonchalant. Like time is money or you won't be nonchalant. Like time is money. Like I don't have time to be playing these games with you because you're really sapiosexual. And I feel like they knew it. They knew how to get to your mind. You could be the older woman, but I feel like they thought they knew how to get to your mind. Let me correct that. You could be the older woman or the older male, but with the Eight of Swords, yeah, they were trying to get you stuck, trying to control your mind. This is Jedi shit, like, <laughs> like they was really trying to, like, it could be with an air sign, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra, but this is definitely somebody who was um, very clever, very, very smart, very intellectual, know how to get to your mind. They know how to push your buttons. You're, they know where you need healing at. And they're going to push them. Yeah, with the four of cups. This person was like, not just paying attention to you, but someone else. I feel like they got, the sh they slipped up. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, with the queen of pentacles and the justice, they could be married. They could be getting a divorce. Or they could have said they was getting a divorce and they wanted to start something new with you. But this person was really keeping things still. Like they was putting things on hold on purpose because they were talking to somebody else. Like you could be the other woman or male and they are married with a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo. Or somebody who's like, I'm getting well seasoned. That's what I keep hearing. Well seasoned. Yeah, look, they were being sneaky with you. Sly as a fox. I told you they're really clever. And then it's like... You need to walk away. I feel like if you have not gotten clarity yet, you're about to get something as clear as day. They're saying you need to be smart. Be smart. I feel like the truth is about to be revealed probably by the other woman, maybe. But I don't think it's going to be from your person. I don't think they're going to tell the truth. You're going to hear the truth from someone else. It could be from a family member that know your person. But with the moon card, this is definitely something being revealed. I don't know why they're going to decide it, but it, like I said with the high priestess, that's the energy of people knowing stuff, but they're not saying nothing. So definitely that's what was going on. But divine intervention. Yeah, look, I told you it was like somebody was already in a committed relationship with someone in the past. This could definitely be with someone they were with for a long time. Um, I think you need to free yourself. You're going to be a little sad. You're going to be a little heartbroken when you hear this, but they say at least it's a divine intervention because you will be fulfilled with the answer you got because I feel like you dodged a bullet. Yeah, this person was going back and forth. It could be with you. And oh my goodness, it's just like the air sign reading. You might want to check out that air sign reading. But yeah, this could be somebody you were working with and they were trying to act like they were single or they were getting divorced, but they weren't. And really, with the five of wands, I feel like it's about to be something. Y'all about to get angry. Like, y'all about to set it off on them. Because when you find out this, and you're not even about to find out from this person, that's going to piss you off. Yeah, y'all going to break up. If y'all, I mean, I don't even think y'all dating, dating. I think y'all were just talking. But this person was really trying to pull a fast one when really they was in a long-term committed relationship. Yeah, look, they were trying to, like, avoid the conflict. They're trying to, like, keep their distance. But no, bring your ass here, boy. <laughs> I don't even know where that came from. But what is the outcome of this spirit? <laughs> listen, we got to laugh to keep from crying, y'all. Okay, do just laugh about it. But, like, listen, I'm glad I dodged that bully, period. Okay, I'm the friend that you gonna laugh with. We not crying over here. Like, that's period. So, yeah, the spirit is saying stay strong. Hold your dignity. Let go of whatever is clinging you to them. Keep your guard up. Stay strong. Hold yourself back from this person. Because this person, all they're gonna do is the same shit over and over and over. And they probably trying some sex magic. So, stay clear from that. I feel like you're gonna be newly single. You're starting a new beginning by yourself. But new love is coming in. 
But once you release this burden and separate yourself from this Gemini, possibly, it could be a Gemini, but separate yourself from this person. Do not weigh yourself on this person because time is money, period. Go make that money for you and your family. All right, my fellow water signs, I hope this resonates. If it did, you know what to do. Support your girl, and thank you for supporting me already. I appreciate you guys, and I love you.